changes taking away our shared heritage and natural resources fast. The receding glaciers are just one example raised at the Himalayan Consensus Summit in Kathmandu, where participants exchanged views on sustainable development in South Asia. David Morton is the Director General of the International Center for Integrated Mountain Development. He says that what happens in the Himalayas will not just affect the region, but the whole world. If our water resources change, say because of climate change, it's likely to have impacts downstream. So China, you have Yellow River, Yangtze River coming from the Himalayas. You already have water scarcity. Uh, what that means for the energy resources, that's an issue. The food production, that's an issue as well. We need the economic uh, development growth. On the other hand, we need to work closely with communities and have an ecological society that pays attention to ecosystems. In fact, community-based adaptations and solutions are being built up in Nepal through the integrated management of the agricultural, water, forestry, and biodiversity sectors. Nepal, as a Himalayan country, has already felt the climate change impact on its water resources. However, the Nepalese people are trying to make some changes to their conservation efforts. In the process of reconstruction after the 2015 earthquake, energy saving and heritage preserving ideas were incorporated into rebuilding places such as iconic Durbar squares. Now people are building their houses back, like the houses were a couple of hundred years ago. So which means that people are saying that if I would conserve, it would be get into a better heritage hotel and I can make more money. And then I would recycle my water, I would uh, you know, uh, recycle my trash. So if you do all this, so you can work around conservation and preservation and still make good economic sense. And a special key message from the summit is that once awareness and consensus is reached, new technologies represented by AI robots can play a positive role in growth and the environment for the larger good of mankind. Well, that's CGTN, Kathmandu.